We're here at St Pancras International Station in London for Art Cop 21. Up next is the incredible, amazing, one of the best spoken word artists of our time, Kathy Jetnell Kidner. Dear Mata Felibinum, you are a seven month old sunrise of gummy smiles. You are bald as an egg and bald as a Buddha. You are thighs that are thunder, shrieks that are lightning, so excited for bananas, hugs, and our morning walks along the lagoon. Dear Mata Filipinum, I want to tell you about that lagoon, that lucid, sleepy lagoon lounging against the sunrise. Men say that one day that lagoon will devour you. They say it will gnaw at the shoreline, chew at the roots of your breadfruit trees, gulp down rows of sea walls, and crunch through your island's shattered bones. They say you, your daughter, and your granddaughter too will wander, rootless, with only a passport to call home. Dear Mata Filipinum, don't cry. Mommy promises you no one will come and devour you. No greedy whale of a company sharking through political seas. No backwater bullying of businesses with broken morals. No blindfolded bureaucracies gonna push this mother ocean over the edge. No one's drowning, baby. No one's moving. No one's losing their homeland. No one's gonna become a climate change refugee. Or should I say no one else? To the Carteret Islanders of Papua New Guinea and to the Taro Islanders of the Solomon Islands, I take this moment to apologize to you. We are drawing the line here because we, baby, are going to fight. Your mommy, daddy, boo boo, jima, your country, and your president, too, we will all fight. And even though there are those hidden behind platinum titles who like to pretend that we don't exist, who like to pretend that the Marshall Islands, Tuvalu, Kiribati, Maldives, Typhoon Haiyan in the Philippines, the thousands of floods in Algeria and Colombia and Pakistan and all the earthquakes and hurricanes and tidal waves didn't exist? Still, there are those who see us, hands reaching out, fists raising up, banners unfurling, megaphones booming, and we are canoes blocking coal ships. We are the radiance of solar villages. We are the fresh, clean soil of a farmer's past. We are petitions blooming from teenage fingertips. We are families biking, recycling, reusing, engineers, dreaming, designing, building, artists, painting, dancing, writing. We are spreading the word. And there are thousands out on the street, marching hand in hand, chanting for change now. And they're marching for you, baby. They're marching for us because we deserve to do more than just survive. We deserve to thrive. Dear Mata Filipino, you are eyes heavy with drowsy weight. So just close those eyes and sleep in peace because we won't let you down. You'll see. Thank you.